I'm one of those people that think that Crawford can beat Alvarez. I think Crawford can beat Alvarez. I think it's going to be tough. He's going to have to fight the perfect fight. But I think if anybody could do it, it would be him. So I'm not going to say that I don't think he could beat Alvarez anymore because of this fight. But one thing that did concern me was the lead right hand that Maj Jamal consistently landed. He was snapping Crawford's head back on a consistent basis with that. And I think that Canelo is sharper than Alvarez. He, he, he doesn't have the Majumal feet, but he's a better overall fighter, and I think he's a little sharper. So I still think that Crawford has a shot to beat Canelo. Um, I know that Canelo will be the favorite, and uh, it's a very good chance that uh, Canelo could clip Crawford. Canelo can punch, and that right hand does bother me because Canelo knows how to fight southpaw, and Canelo's also operating on autopilot. He he he's another master. He's an all-time great. So it's things that he would do to throw Crawford off, and he would go to Crawford's body. You no, know, um, I have fighters who've been in camp with Canelo, and I have fighters who actually fought Canelo, and they all tell me he's brutal to the body. So I think it will it, it will be one of them fights where. Crawford will have to come up with a trick. Like something to throw him up. He would have to fight like a, a perfect fight. I don't think he can knock him out, but I do think he can outpoint him. Crawford came in to the fight with uh, Majel weighing 169 pounds on fight night. Would he, I mean, would he need time to adjust to a higher weight if he was to take on someone like Canelo Alves? Or do you think he can walk straight in there? and take on Canelo at that sort of super middleweight. I, I just think he would come in on his natural weight. But Crawford understands the science of boxing. He got a good team around him. They're going to have him come in at the weight that's most beneficial to him. I don't think he's going to weigh in at 168 because it wouldn't make any sense to do that. You know, he doesn't want to slow himself down. But he knows what weight he needs to come in at, and they, they're going to have him right for that. Yeah, I mean, I would... I would favor Crawford as well, slightly, but yeah, you just don't know with um, pu- you know, pushing that extra weight around for 12 rounds, how it's going to affect him, as well as having Alvarez on his tail the whole 10, 12 rounds. Uh, it's, it's a tough one, isn't it? Uh-